Right, we're on this little train coach for a change, and uh, we're on it for about an hour. And uh, we're going to just uh, take you along for the ride. Hope you enjoy this with us. Around the local towns and stages, doing the old walking challenge, isn't it? Nine euros each. Nine euros each. It runs every hour, so uh, from the hotel, directly outside the front of the hotel. So let's see what this is all about. So it's two carriages along this um, little train. Off we go. Apparently it's a little bit bumpy, but uh, we don't mind that, shall we? No, it's not a fun fair ride. Of course it is. This is where we walk down many a, a night time, folks. Where you get all the little bistros and tavernas during the day. They look like they're all closed up. But at night time, this road comes to life. Oh, hello. So as you probably remember, we walked along here before. And we come down here last night, didn't we, Sharon? See, there's quite a selection of uh, shops down here and also as I said before loads of vehicles to hire as well we'd like to hire one of them little buggies there but uh, never got around to it and just across the road there as well more to hire out this little uh, taverna over here looks lovely at night time all this up although it's all white it goes a sort of a creamy orangey uh, glow a lot of uh, candle light, table light. Looks lovely at night time, that one. Exactly the same with this one as well. So many eateries outside. stops for the train station. It doesn't look like you're stopping that Sharon. You just drive on. It's like it's like on the buses. When Stan used to drive past the buses. <laughs> Bus stops. This is a hotel where the other couple stayed at who was on the airport bus with us. We, they got dropped off first. As you can see one two five power resort. Loads more hotels here. Look. And as you can see, we're still right on the um, edge of the. Uh, I call it the Aegean Sea now. So, shall I stop upsetting a few people when we call it the Mediterranean. Just go in here. There's Patty's Cocktail Bar there, we've never been in there. We're actually going onto the uh, front of the beach now. And I don't know what you can see folks, but the uh, mountains in the background are a lot clearer today. Hello, Shao. And the turquoise blue sea turns into a darker blue about 50 yards out. Yeah, we haven't been this far down, Sharon, have we? We've come most of the way down this road, but not this last sort of 500 yards. Well, I bet he picks it up on the way back. No, the side of the road. Back, yeah, he probably didn't drive them on that bus stop. Yeah. Yeah, you're right, Shell. So. It's on the right side of the road, aren't you? Yeah, he 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 didn't he didn't drive past them. He's actually stopping to pick them up now. So uh, I'm not sure exactly how many stops that these uh, have, but uh, there are two carriages here. So I don't think there'll be too many stops, Sharon. No, nearly four, I think, isn't it? Is he nearly yeah. four? Yeah. Yeah. Right, so we're on the road again. Again, this is a road we've walked many a times. All these little 
cocktail bars at Tavernas. This is now heading towards the main, I call the main road in uh, Ilios, where we actually pick up the main bus to go to the old town. down here at the traffic lights turn left follow straight along the coastal road and that will take you to the old town Ciao. so for the, those of these people watching We'll pick up there nine euros at the end of the journey. So here's the traffic lights. Just turn left there. Over on the other side of the road, you'll get the bus stop to the old town. This is about 8.5 kilometres away. And uh, that way's the airport. Eh? That way's the airport. And that way over there is the airport. Yeah. What if that's a police station there, Shadow? Oh, yeah. anything look two old boys there sitting down look having a cup of coffee is it yeah so yeah this is the turnaround point right by the little tiny fire station over there look at that look it's unbelievable isn't it only one fire station over there and they're both sitting over there at the back there having a cup of tea or coffee. Right, coming towards the end of our tour now. The, uh, the GNC is just on the left hand side now, we've actually turned round. Which is where we went on a previous video, albeit by bus. Sharon? Instead of train, we went to the old town on bus. Oh, and car. Oh, and car. Yeah, of course we did, yeah. Proper Greek restaurants as well. And again, all these hotels here, all back onto the beach. So there we go, baby. We've got off a stop before, haven't we? Yeah. We thought we'd just do the shops because he's just gone in to get a box of fags or something, hasn't he? Well, or toilet. Or a toilet. We might have nicked home. Yeah, where are you going? Let's have a look at the front of this. Here? Let's have a little look here, look. Let's have a look at the front of this. There's his little motorised uh, trailer there, folks. Look. There we go. Petrol driven. Or is it diesel? Probably diesel driven, isn't it? There you go. That's the little train. Nine euros, Sharon. That's fine, isn't it? Yeah. 
always got to remember when you cross the road here, look left first, folks. Look left, look right, look left again, Sharon. Yeah. What the highway Green Cross Crowman used to say, but the other way around, eh? Yeah. What's that? Be, uh, 7 euros 80. That's very cheap. Hello, do you want to try that later? No. Why? Because I'm walking back that way and I like my soup. Look at that, folks, look. I thought we might like to try that for lunch here, that's all. What do you want, honey? Yeah, well, it's something different, isn't it? For that money, we don't mind, do we? We're on holiday, baby. So that took probably, yeah, it's coming up to 11 o'clock now, so just under an hour, folks. And it was a nice little uh, jolt. Seeing other parts we haven't gone down, little roads we haven't gone down, and seeing just outside the the complex where we are, the more rural side of it sort of thing. So, yeah, well worth doing that, folks, if you come here. And uh, someone said that I say Sharon too much in the videos again, Sharon, or baby. Watch this, Martin, 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 Martin. And that you don't say at any time, Martin, once. But I've tried to explain to people, Sharon, I have to do the commentary. Yeah. And that's what I have to do. And that is my name. So if, I'm afraid if it offends you, I'm very, very sorry, but that's what I do. What do you call your partner when you want them? Yeah, but normally, Shao, the, the message which I've got to Shao again, look, the message I'm trying to get across is that when we're not on camera, we don't, we don't call your names all the time. No. And you don't call my name all the time unless I want you for something. But we have to explain something to other people, and my way to get you to come into the conversation sometimes is to call you. And I can call you she, her, it, they. I've done that before, and people Still take offence. They say to call her by her name. Martin. So there you go. Martin. Happy days, folks. Happy days. We're on holiday. <laughs> well, hello. Come back this way. Where are you going? You use my name, Sharon. I did. I did. Unbelievable. I didn't use it in vain. Of course you didn't. All right, let's have a look in one of these little local shops then. Who's that for? No one. Just what is fair. Just having a look. Yeah. There we go, little tourist shop, folks. There we go. He wants a hoodie, doesn't he? He wants a hoodie, does he? Yeah. yeah. I thought we'd come into a local shop just to show you, folks. Because you like coming shopping. They like coming shopping, don't they, baby? It's not a Tesco, is it? Eh? It's not a Tesco. It's not a Tesco, no. It's a different experience. Yeah. Yeah, look, Greek candies, look. Ouzo flavoured. Fruit flavoured. Fruit flavoured toffees. I've never heard of a Ouzo flavoured uh, sweet before. These look nice. I've, I've seen them. We used to have similar ones to these in the UK. They're jelly fruits with a picture of the fruit on the front. And then you've got these sort of coated, sesame coated peanuts there as well. Apart from the normal uh, UK stuff we're familiar with. There we go. Riddle, that's a riddle, isn't it? Nice. Very nice. Coming around here, let's have a look here. Look. This is how they serve their bread normally in these little local shops. You get a local uh, buns and rolls of homemade, I think. They're all gone on there. Well, you've got the, um, the pre-packaged stuff down there. All the uh, spices and stuff and fish peas. That's different, isn't it? Heinz beans. There we go. All these uh, orange and chocolate flavoured olive oil. Look at that. Extra virgin. Truffle and Mario Am. All these, hey? Eh? Of course you can, baby. I'm just showing them all these different sort of um, herbs and stuff they got here, and oils and stuff. Look at that, look. Yeah, look at the price of that. Look, that's, that's extra virgin, uh, virgin, five euros ninety-five in a tin. Little tin, look. What is that? Salt. Tzatziki mix. Let's go around the other side. Yeah, we're showing them some different stuff today, Sharon. This is a cold fridge, look, with all the um, cheeses and stuff. Edam, Gouda, I don't know what that one is. Iced coffee, one euro and forty. What's that? Seven What's that for, a lemonade, seven up? Six cans. There's the old baklava, that's very sweet, that. I've never had one. Well, I might have had one years ago, but uh, these ones, 
So it says they're handmade. What's that then? What is it? Handmade Greek delight. They're, they're out for breakfast, don't they? I don't know, Sharon. I've never you seen know, it. I showed you it to the you thought it was a jelly bag. Oh, them things, yeah. You said it's like a Turkish delight, didn't you? Yeah. But they call it Greek delight here because we're in Greece, obviously. There we go. Lots of selection. And there you go. Oh, the train's gone. What a shame, Sharon. Slight bit of rust on that bonnet, Sharon. <laughs> Go on in, off you go. Yeah, so their shops sort of do everything, shall they? Don't they? Clothing. Well, it's all about the hotel, toys. Well, it's, so yeah, it's, it's, it's stocked for the. Uh, to reel you in yeah. and it does. Well, it's only 11 o'clock, so I'm not really hungry yet, so. We might as well walk back to the hotel, maybe get a coffee. And then this is where we're looking at coming back, folks. Look. Nice little ambience. And they've got fans above your head, Sharon, as well. Blow cool air on you. We'd like to try a little something slightly outside. I know we're getting all inclusive but uh it's just it's something else anyway, yeah i know but that's quite a good little deal isn't it all right nearly back to the hotel oh look at that show hello oh, oh yeah lovely one that one isn't it show you've got a nice meow it's like a little growl no it's a lovely one isn't it come running over to your show and oh. there's something we haven't seen a lot of show look one of these things yeah electric car hardly seen any of them at all have we Right, we're That's nearly the back. charging point I've seen at all. Yeah, I've seen a couple of them, but as I say, there's compared to the amount of vehicles here, whatever, all we can see here, that's the only point there. It's just that the infrastructure's not there, shall is it? And the, um, for the size of these vehicles, the battery capabilities doesn't warrant the size of the vehicle, does it? No. But that's just my opinion. Who's I? Who am I, Cheryl? I've got a new friend. Of course you have. Come on in, let's go back to the hotel, get a cold drink. But we thought we'd just throw this one in on the Saturday. We weren't going to put one out today, but we thought we'd just show you what we're getting up to, just lazying about, doing our own thing without filming, which we are filming, funny enough. <laughs> right, so we're just coming back into the uh, main reception, folks. And underneath the dining area, or next to the main bar inside, is where we've been uploading and downloading stuff. But coming in here, this area, this area here, show, apart from it being lovely and cool, here is the fastest upload and download speed we've yeah. got on this resort, folks. That means so such a lot to me. If you're going to download some films to go into your room, come to the reception, just sit at this little table here, download them, then go back to your room and watch them. Yeah. I think we was getting 180 to 200 upload and download speeds there, megabytes. So this is where we've been coming, when we've been uploading the videos for you to see. Right, let's go have a cold drink, Sharon. After being out in that heat, Sharon, so lovely to come into this cool area here. A nice fruit draft here as well, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, so this is just a normal leisurely day for us. We're going to get a cold glass of water. And Sharon's going to walk with a horse. And we're going to sit out by the sea afterwards, Sharon, straight through there. Ah, there's a lovely little princess. All nice and relaxed, isn't ya? Oh, yeah. We've had a nice relaxing morning, haven't we? Yeah. So we're just going to go back to that outside hotel and we'll have something to eat there. Murder. The what? Murder. Of course it is. See you in a minute. Hotel. Well, we found it, Sharon. It's straightforward. Of course it was. It was a straight line, wasn't it? Yeah. Come on in. Let's have a look. Let's have a see what you're going to have here. It is very pretty, isn't it? So we've got. Uh, I think I'm going to go for the hamburger with French fries and a soft drink. So let's have a little go in here. We've got to be careful, folks, because of the uh, music. Let's have a look here. After um, what's that? Is that the same one or a different one? No, that's a special plate for two people. Which is twenty cent. No, it's too much, isn't it? We don't need that, do we? Where do you want to sit? Away from the speaker, if possible. Uh, we're going to have the special over there. Yeah, I'll have the hamburger one, please. You like soft drinks, small beer? Have you got Sprite Zero? No. 
Uh, any soft, sugar-free drink? Uh, cola Zero. Cola Zero would be cola fine. Light. Cola Light, yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's right. One Sprite, but it's not uh, Zero. Eh? That's fine, yeah. The Cola Light, okay? We sit here, is that fine? Yeah. Brilliant, thank you. Right, that's it. That's us, uh, ready, Sharon? Already ordered? So we'll uh, give this place a little bit of a look. Have a little pan round it, folks, look. Nice little taverna. Literally right out of the sun here, as you can see, they've got this, um, in fact, that's all real shrubbery above our nut, Sharon. It's lovely, isn't it? So one of the uh, original Travernas here. So we've got to do a lot of talking while we're eating because, as I say, there is music playing here and we don't know about the copyright. So uh, just bear with us. I've just done a conversion, uh, seven pounds eighty share, and works out at six pounds seventy four at the moment. That's cheaper than the McDonald's. Meal. Cheaper than the McDonald's. Oh, well, I hope we've got a street salesman over here. Look at that. What's he selling? Toilet paper. That's <laughs> unusual. And kitchen roll. Used to seeing scrap men, Sharon, but uh, never someone coming along the road selling a toilet roll. <laughs> no, that's the first for me, actually. So you're missing your lunchtime buffet, but uh, don't forget we'll be there this evening. We've shown the well, we've shown the afternoon buffet anyway, haven't we? Mm. So it's just something a little bit different. Uh, we thought we'd bring to these people, and it's just nice watching the the traffic go by, Sharon. We're not on the main road here, but um, you see so many people. Just on, behind them is the sea, isn't it? Yeah, just just behind them blocks there, folks. That is the uh, the sea's actually there. But you see people buzzing along on these scooters. I know they say we've got no crash helmets on or whatever, and they're just in their shirt sleeves and a pair of shorts. But of all, it's all ages, Sharon, isn't it? I mean, yeah, the scooter similar. drivers we, we've seen them with old people on, two up, mother, husband and wife, yeah, sort of thing. Than us. Yeah, and they're, they're not just old people; they're very old people. Yeah. And you know, it's it's just a totally different way of life, and it doesn't seem to matter. And it's a lovely, smooth way of life. Mm. No stress. No one's rushed or panicked. Just chilling out on a afternoon, a weekday afternoon. Wednesday, isn't it? Is it Wednesday? Well, no, this goes out on Saturday. Uh -huh. So it's a Wednesday for us, but it's a Saturday for them. This is the day, folks, we weren't going to um, film on. But we thought we'd just um, bring it to you because, as I say... Because we can! Although this is Wednesday, we've done all our filming because we've been here for two weeks. We've done all, most of our filming on the first week and half of the second week. So we've got the Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, where we don't need to film because all them videos are already lined up. So that's just a perk of getting here and being in front of the videos. And uh, when we went to Benidorm, we was only a day in front, but here we're sort of three or four days in front, shall we? Yeah. Anyway, let's wait for the grub to come, folks. Give it a taste test, see what it's like. And basically, we'll set a table here for you and you enjoy us. Right, baby, yours has just turned up. You've gone for the uh, Giros. With uh, obviously French fries and the, um, I think it looks like the lamb one you went for, wasn't it? I just went for gyros. That's all it says up there. Love. Yeah, and I went for the uh, burger. With I've got a sauce with mine, Sharon. As well, look, we've got a nice bit of salad in there. Uh, burger. Oh yeah, loads of loads of onions, Sharon. Look. Well, I'll have a good burger. And the burger on the burger on the bottom there. So let's have a close look, shall? Go on in, baby, in you go. Go on, burn your mouth, he says. Burn your mouth. Them fries look nice and crunchy, don't they? Oh, they're nice. Not greasy, lovely. No, they're not greasy at all, are they? Let's see what the old uh, gyros, gyros is going to be like, Shout. I see they've done it nicely wrapped up for you there, and they've stuck chips in it as well, Shout. Mm. I'll take a little bite on that. How's that taste? <laughs> you made the wrong move. <laughs> Did I? Let's have a look just on the inside, shall we? Really it looks tasty, I must say. Yeah, you've got. A, is there garlic a dip sauce, on there? Yeah, it's garlic. Lovely. Garlic dip there, which only looks like I've got on the side there, Sharon. Mm. So yeah, 
It's nice with the, the extra chips inside it, and it just yeah. bolts it out a bit more, isn't it? Looks very nice, baby. Very nice. Right, well, I'm just going to go in for the chips first, folks, just to have a little go with that dip. I'm not sure what this dip is. Probably the same as watching Sharon's burger. I haven't got a mm. burger. Sorry, your gyro. Gyros. Gyros. <laughs> Can't mm. say gyros. How did I ever go at you? Mmm. It's actually like like a McDonald's sauce. I'm like not the Big Mac, so stop it. It's very tasty. Very tasty indeed. And again, proper fries. Nice and crisp. Now, I'm going to have a go at this burger. Oh, that's red hot. Let's turn it upside down. There we go. Mmm. Lovely. Well, very tasty burger. Tastes definitely tastes the onions in there, and the burger as well. And it's all red hot. This food, Sharon. It's better than McDonald's meal, isn't it? Freshly cooked, and that's where it is. Can you see that, Sharon? Yeah. That is literally about 500 yards, I suppose, from our our um, hotel. So I'm just going to eat this. I'll let Sharon eat hers, folks, and. Um, We'll see you at the end, but that's not bad for £6.74. Well, as I say, it's cheaper than a Big Mac meal. And hotter. Yeah. See you in a minute, folks. So including the price. Plenty of ice in that as well makes it ice cold. You can't beat it. There we go. Totally clean plate, Shan. Well worth the money that one, wouldn't it? Yep, very nice. Seven euros eighty, which is six pounds seventy-four. We're full up. We've had been fed and watered, and all we've got to do is pay the bill now. <laughs> then we're going back to the pool, and we're gonna have a bit of a sunbathe. And we might have a little go, well I might have a little go at the karaoke tonight, Sharon. Oh, you're thinking about it? We huh? may or may not show you that, folks, depends. We've got to be careful because of the copyright with the uh, music, so we'll see. See you a bit later on. Well done, baby. There we go. Nice little taverna there, folks. Check it out. Zorbos, I think it is. Yeah, there we go. Zorbas, not Zorbos, folks. Family Taverna. And straight back down there is the hotel, Sharon. Yeah? Oh, you look like a goalie, Sharon. Save the ball. I'll throw the ball. Look, catch it. Catch it. Or are you Samson? <laughs> Support little family businesses, exactly, Sharon. There's something you don't often see, folks. Look at that, look. Cat and a chicken, look, you don't get to see that very often, do you? <laughs> the chicken's not worried about the cat at all, is he? Amazing. There's one there. Look, look little cats, look. <laughs> He's looking at the balls, like a meerkat show, isn't it? Yeah, look at that. that chicken's not worried at all about that, look. And the cat's not bothered about the chicken, look.
There we go folks that's just a leisurely day today just showing you what we probably really get up to when we we're on our own without the camera turned on although we've had the camera turned on we've had a nice little journey out we've had a nice meal out we're now going to go down by the pool or by the sea we're not too sure yet we're going to enjoy this afternoon and uh, thanks very much for coming along with us on that little journey anyway don't forget do have a little binge watch of our Greek videos and failing that pop over to our other playlist where we've done our Benidorm visit and you'll probably enjoy that as well if you like this sort of thing. Where to go next? Who knows? We've got a few more little travel, local travel videos in the UK when we get back. They're only local ones so um, we're going to do a, a little meet up with a couple of, um, well one YouTuber and uh, a radio personality as well. So keep your eye out for them ones. That's all coming up on Butler's Empire channel as well as some more cooking videos as well. Hope you've enjoyed this video folks. We'll see you in the next one and until then Bye for now.